Hello, Patrick Walchuk here, and we're bringing you a financial analysis on a property that's located outside of Ottawa, just to show you what's happening there uh, versus you know what goes on in, inside the city. Now, this property was located an hour and 15 minutes south of Ottawa. It was a six unit building. The numbers are quite amazing. And I want to let you know that this building had both a title issue and a variance issue. The title issue, sorry, the title issue was resolved and the variance issue will be resolved prior to closing. So let's look at this um, six unit building. <clears throat> it was listed for about $991,000. It sold for $990,000. It had a scheduled rental income of $120,000. The effective rental income on the property is $116,000 and change. That's after we deduct for um, uh, vacancy and, and bad debt. <clears throat> now the operating expense uh, was reported as being $27,000. And when we factor in management and maintenance, that gives us a total operating expense of about $38,000. And that gives us an NOI of almost $78,000. So let's interpret what that means. A cap rate that's just out of this world, you know, compared to any property that's selling in Ottawa, it's almost 8%. The operating expense ratios are on the low side. That's terrific. So I think we can see where this story is going and what the conclusion is going to be already. It sold for nine times the gross. I don't know if I've seen that in a long time. Um, it sold for 13 times the net. Now, using kind of my old standard of what happens if you have a 35% down payment, the property should cash flow positive, but maybe not this positive, but it did. So we have a down payment of about $346,000. We know that our mortgage is going to, going to be about $644,000. Now the annual debt service on that mortgage is about $46,000. We know our NOI, we now know our ADS, and that gives us a cash flow annually of $32,000. And that is an ROI of about 9.2%. Now an interesting thing about this property, because it's not in the city, it's on well and septic, so the owner doesn't have any, any water costs that you would associate with uh, that being in the city. So if you want to know more about these rural properties in the small towns and you know literally the, the countryside around Ottawa, we got a great agent that can help you with that. If you enjoy watching these things, give us a shout. Patrick Walchuk.